hanging out with the besties in downtown Sacramento again. Few last few hours before I go home Unless or go back to Seattle. Canceled, canceled not canceled. Canceled. <laughs> <laughs> You're stuck We got motive. We were trying to get some. Uh, what was it? The macaroons. macaroons. And it's closed on Sunday Mondays. Typical. You want frozen yogurt with peanuts? Yeah. It's There's a flavor. Here too. It's a tray cake. Tray cakes. Tray cakes. Sorry, babe. Oh. <laughs> this is the one. The lady who's like, I'm not that hungry. Oh, let's check that out. <laughs> so the pregnant one wasn't hungry, but she's the one who got most of the stuff. Yeah, your red velvet cake. You can't say no to red velvet. You have to save it for later. Yeah. Yeah. You said no. You said no. You said yes to this, but then you said yes to that too. What is that? A banana cream pie. Oh my god. Did you eat your cannoli? It's pretty. Yeah. <laughs> it's pretty. <laughs> what do you have, Lauren? I have a chocolate gelato cookie bowl. Oh my god, it's like warm still? Salted caramel and chocolate chip cookie. Yum. So you just had salted caramel? Yeah. Kahlua cookie. It tastes like coffee. Well, that's hella good. Mm. Can't believe how hot it is. I'm ready to go back to Seattle, kind of, sort of. I miss my friends. Walking back to the car. And we're trying to find somewhere to chill for a few hours. We meet our best friends. The Walgreens. Oh, it's so freaking hot. Oh my god. Enjoy it though, because it's about to get cold when we get back to Seattle. I'd rather be cold. <laughs> trip is coming to an end and I think this is the hardest that I've ever had to like separate from my friends because we were just all crying and just like just like earlier Monica was crying because she misses a uh, family and her best friend and it's just crazy how we're up in Seattle and everyone's here we're all just doing our own thing I think there's just so many life events like yeah. weddings and Babies, so it's just like so much is going on in everyone's life, so it makes it harder. Yeah, it's like it's harder to get to each other when we are basically apart from each other. But when when we're together, we like make the best of it. And I think that's what's awesome about my best friends. It's that when we get together, it's like we never left each other. And and no matter what, it could be just a simple night, like just us playing like apples to apples, like not even going to a bar, not going to a club, like it's just chilling, like like I was the only one drinking just like a couple beers, everyone else was just drinking soda, and we had pizza delivered and all that stuff, and it was just, you know, simple. And it's really hard to come across friends like that, and it's hard for me to like make friends in other places because it's just that I have so much attachment and so much love from the friends that I have here. And holy guacamole, there's traffic. We'll make it. My flight's delayed anyways. It's crazy. You don't have any luggage. I don't have luggage. It's just this one bag and that's it. So that definitely like these friends have been with me friends since like eighth grade like over a decade of friendship it's like really hard to you know find people with that type of you know strong love you can check it too right mm -hmm. same thing uh, we're now to yeah, it's now back to reality and working and just get back to the grind Oh, just about that time. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh. <sighs> it's like a long distance relationship. I know. Oh. Got my okay. Love you. I miss you. A couple more days, okay? Take care of family. Don't cry like Elise. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Keep me updated. Okay. Love you.